Each year we take time to honor nine outstanding volunteers in our community. I spoke with our first Nine Who Care nominee, a 13-year-old artist who's turned his gift in a way to give to others. So I'll be using, um, for the leaves, I'll be using just different shades of green. For my eighth birthday, my parents got me uh, art supplies, and that's kind of how I, I just started from there. From a young age, Arsh Pal has green. painted. And to do random strokes right here. But his heart is much larger than any canvas he sells. It's kind of compelling when you get a you know, a tween at that point reaching out to you and saying, I want to help. Arsh used his art to raise money to support Riverview Center and their services for children who've been sexually abused or seen domestic violence. He knows how healing art can be. Arsh painted at the group's Hope and Healing Art Gallery, earning money. Then he turned around and donated. With the money that I got from selling my artwork, I knew it would go to a good cause. Not just giving money, but his time. Arsh visited Stonehill communities while living in Dubuque to teach art lessons to residents there. They really enjoyed it the first time, so I came back and kept doing it with them. And he continues to give one stroke at a time. Thousands of dollars to St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. It supports kids with cancer, so I really, I really like that. So I really wanted to donate to St. Jude. A tiny brush making a big difference. Do you have any idea at this point how much money you've been able to raise and give back with through your art over the years? So far, I have donated over $17,000. And his art now greets each person. It's the first thing that people notice when they come in, and people often will comment on it and say just how beautiful it is. When they visit the Riverview Center in Waterloo. I mean, there's a lot of adults who haven't figured out their power to use their gifts and talents to help others. And the fact that he learned that so early is just, I'm, I'm a big believer in role modeling out in the world, and I just think he's the exact type of person that we need to be focused, like we need to be featuring like this. Arsh has been featured nationally, from Good Morning America to the Washington Post. Recognition he appreciates, but never went looking for. I mean, I didn't know I, I, I would go this far. I mean, I, and I'm really happy that it's been able to, uh, I've been able to like to share my story with other people. A story with the power to move people like a work of art. I feel really, feel really happy inside. <laughs> He's so impressive. I was honored just to get to talk with him. Yeah, what an amazing kid and raised thousands yeah. of dollars. Oh, yeah, so much money and not keeping it for himself, but using it to help so many people. It's such a young age as well. Yeah. I mean, just think about if he continues to do work like that, how much good he can do. Yeah, it's yeah. pretty neat. Pretty neat indeed.